The only thing that's going to make you happy, my friend, in this year or any other, is to step up. It's to raise the standard. It's to discover what you're capable of and feel that incredible power of pushing through whatever's holding you back and get to the other side of more of your true self. Don't let this year be like last. And if last year was great, still don't let it be that way. Raise the standard. It's not what we get that make us happy. It's who we become and what we're able to give because we become more. You want to know how to change your life and give it to you in three words, boring as it sounds, raise your standards. There's no excuse for not living up to the full potential. No excuse. And I stopped being a victim. I stopped saying I've got to wait for good things to happen to me. And I said I'm going to ride. I'm going to fight. I'm going to work. I'm going to press towards. I'm going to learn. I'm going to do everything in my power every single day. I'm going to do everything in my power to become a victor and not a victim. Winners win and losers lose. I can't explain it any better than that. But winners win. And if you create a culture of losing, if you keep being a victim, it's going to become a culture. What does it take to successfully create a lasting change in your life? To not only have a New Year's resolution you follow through on, but really have a lasting change. The secret is progress. Getting things is not going to make you happy. That's good news in a tough economy. It's a good reminder. You know, it doesn't matter what you get. It doesn't matter whether it be money or opportunity. All those things might excite you for the moment. You know, even a relationship, as magnificent it may be, might be exciting for a while. But if you don't keep growing, that relationship isn't going to stay excited. Progress equals happiness. And if we can make progress on a regular basis, we feel alive. And that's why at the beginning of the year, we get this thing like, okay, I can have this fresh start. I can really do what my soul desires. I can expand. I can grow. I can improve. I can change. Or maybe better than change, I can progress. yourself in the mirror and said, who let you die? Until you get to that point, you let you die. You never, you're not brave enough. You want to put it on somebody else. The reason why I'm not successful is because of my boss. Have you ever looked at yourself in the mirror and said, I'm not getting up on time. I'm not going to work on time. I'm not putting in 120% when I'm at work. I let me down. I have standards. I have value. I value myself enough to give 120% or don't do it. That's the problem with some of you. You always want to blame other people. You always want to, you want to hold other people to the fire, but you're not holding yourself to the fire. You need to tell you no more TV, no more snacks, no more dessert, no more, no, we working out now. No, no more alcohol, not right now. Not, no, I can't handle it right now. You need to tell you that you owe you something. You, want, you know what's so funny? We want people to make guarantees to us, but we're not willing to make guarantees to ourselves. And if you're going to be successful in life, if you're going to nail it, if you're going to go from good to great, you've got to get to a point where you go from now to birth. What does that mean? Action. You have a poverty mindset. And you don't even know it. You were raised around people who couldn't see the forest for the trees, who never believed that next level success was achievable, that next level success was attainable. You can't overcome that. You can't take your misery and turn it into history. And I speak from experience because I was born and raised in the grimy. I was born and raised in the gutter. I was born and raised in a place that people never thought success could come from. So I feel your pain. But I flipped it. I made the choice. I made the decision to become somebody because I am somebody. And guess what? You are somebody too. I know the world might have dealt you a bad hand in life, but we all love a great comeback story. 
And we all root for the underdog So I need you to climb from up under that rock And understand that you are the rock And I need you to start walking with success I need you to start feeling that success I need you to breathe success I need you to believe success I need you to receive affirmation of success I need you to achieve success See, success doesn't come to you You go to it It's all mental though See, what I had to do Is take the necessary steps To put myself in a position To achieve my desired outcome See, right now You're doing something And that something Is leading you to some level of success Now I need you to ask yourself Will the level of success you achieve Be what others perceive as failure? Or will it be what others perceive as success? The choice is yours. I need you to put your mind. I need you to put your heart. I need you to put your soul. No, no, no. I need you to pour your mind. I need you to pour your soul. I need you to pour your heart into every little thing you do. I mean the smallest of acts. Because that is the secret of success. The great Dr. Eric Thomas said, you got to want to succeed as bad as you want to breathe. So I need you to breathe the success. I need you to live the success. I don't need you looking back. I don't need you looking ahead. I need you 10 toes down, one step at a time. I need you to come up with a plan. And I need you to execute that plan. And I need you to revise when things don't go the way that you want them to go And start again Execute, execute, execute You are the success I don't care what your mama said I don't care what your daddy said I don't care what your brother said I don't care what your sister said I don't care what your cousin said Success is yours for the taking it's your God-given right. So many of us never achieve that next level success because we fail to believe that it's for us. But it's for us by us. But if we don't chase that dream, it's impossible for us to catch it. You are success personified. Just in your heart of hearts, you got to believe it. And every word in this video, I'm saying you got to receive it. I'm your affirmation. Success is yours for the taking. And all you got to do is go grab it. This is a great day to win.